In this video, I'm taking a look at the Boba Fett Funko Pop from Star Wars The Book of Boba Fett. Let's jump right into it. Hey everyone, my name is Christopher, welcome to Seriously Star Wars. On this channel I do weekly Star Wars reviews, so if you're new here, make sure you hit that subscribe button along with the notification bell so you don't miss any future videos. Alright, so today I'm checking out the Boba Fett Funko Pop from Star Wars The Book of Boba Fett. This is the, the first in the series of the first wave. This is the first Funko Pop in the first wave from the Book of Boba Fett. Uh... Boba Fett here is number 480 in the series. The wave consists of Boba Fett and Fennec Shand. I just picked up Fennec Shand earlier this month, like last week pretty much. Um, so I'll be doing a review later, probably next month for that one. But let's jump into the review for Boba Fett here. So he's got that brand new artwork and color scheme going on for Star Wars The Book of Boba Fett. So you got the red around the series number there, and as I mentioned, he's number 480 in the series. Um, you got the Star Wars logo, you got the, the Funko Pop branding, typical branding, and he has the kind of green color scheme going on with the, the artwork of Tatooine in the background. So you got on the side there and the back, you have the, the binary sunset the, the twin sons, you got the Sands of Tatooine, and then you got the Jabba's Palace, or the former Jabba's Palace, now Boba Fett's Palace, I suppose. So, really nice artwork on this box. Really loving the the color scheme they got going on here. Of course, you got the, the character name on the two sides there. On the back, it's got that Star Wars The Book of Boba Fett logo. And as I mentioned, this first wave consists of Boba Fett and Fennec Shan, so let's get Boba Fett out of the packaging. Let's take a closer look at him. Alright, so here is Boba Fett out of the packaging. I'm just going to set him down for a minute, though. Um, so, I don't usually pull out the inserts on these Funko Pops, but... I just wanted to point out the Boba Fett's insignia or his symbol or whatever. I'm, I can't remember exactly what it is, but it's a Boba Fett symbol. It's the one that he has on his his chest plate, on his right chest plate. So they have that as the cardboard insert at the back behind the Funko Pop. So really quickly wanted to point that one out. But back to the Funko Pop, there is Boba Fett out of the packaging. And I think he looks fantastic. They gave him a really nice new paint job. He's obviously at this point in the show re-armored, but has some battle damage there. So, really nice detail on him. I love lately how Funko's been doing their characters with helmets. They have the, the gloss black for the visor, and then the matte for the rest of the helmet. So, that's a really nice touch. I love that. And this character, this this version of Boba Fett looks super awesome. Lots of details on him. So, you got nice little textures on his robes at the back there. You got some nice details on his jetpack there. He is missing his rocket on his jetpack. But nice little details there. You got some blues, some greens on his left shoulder pad. You do have the Mythosaur skull. I don't know if you can pick that up on camera there, but you got the Mythosaur skull on his left shoulder pad. He's got the the nice freshly painted yellow knee armor pieces. The one that has the little Missiles that fire from his knees there on both sides. Very cool looking Funko Pop. Lots of detail like I mentioned. You got some ammunition in his belt there. So you can see some gold 
pieces there. So much detail on this Funko Pop. Like, they even put quite a bit of detail on the, just the side of his viewfinder there, the little bit that pops down there. So on this one, they put some kind of black and, and silver details on there. But very detailed Funko Pop. Just loving this one. They did a fantastic job on this one. And I can't wait to see what other Funko Pops they bring out for this the Book of Boba Fett. Um, like I said, this one and Fennec Shand are the first two in this, this wave from the Book of Boba Fett. And this one, they did a fantastic job on the first Book of Boba Fett Funko Pop. Overall, just a fantastic looking Funko Pop. Paint application is spot on. The sculpt is fantastic. Lots of little details on this. Very detailed. The stance, he just looks very, very badass. Boba Fett does look so badass in his pose. And, of course, you know, being Boba Fett, he is one of my favorite characters, if not my favorite character from Star Wars, so... This pop is just fantastic. Probably probably one of the best Boba Fett Funko Pops to date. Um, very, very cool Funko Pop. If you're a Boba Fett fan, definitely pick this one up. But, guys, let me know in the comments, what do you guys think of the uh, Boba Fett Funko Pop? The very first book of Boba Fett Funko Pop, Boba Fett. Let me know down in the comments. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and then click over here to watch one of my other reviews. Thank you so much for watching, and may the force be with you.